So today we're exploring this abandoned structure. There's really not much to it, but this small little feature here. So I want to kind of reintroduce to you before we dive into this, what this channel is all about. So check this out. This is the Flooring Post Office. It was established in 1906 in Nicotti, Nevada, and its historical reference point associated with the early 20th century mining boom in the region. Here are some key details. The historical context of this small structure was during the mining boom. The establishment of the post office coincided with a period of intense mining activity in Nevada, particularly for minerals such as fluorite, gold, and silver. Nye County was a significant mining hub during this time. Fluorite mining. The name fluorin likely references the mining of fluorite, a mineral used in the production of hydrofluoric acid and in the processing of other metals. Establishment and operations. Opening date. The fluorine post office was established on March 23, 1906. This period marked a peak in the establishment of postal services to support mining communities. Function. The post office served the local mining community, providing essential services, such as mail delivery, a vital link to the outside world for miners and their families. This is an open pit mine, and the size of an open pit fluorite mine can vary greatly depending on the deposit size. Typical dimensions can range from small pits to large operations spanning several hectares. Depths can reach up to hundreds of meters. For instance, large-scale mines might have pits up to 500 meters deep and several kilometers wide. As this is the fluorine mine in Nye County, Nevada, just outside of Beatty, Nevada. The Decline of the Fluorine Post Office the Florine Post Office was short-lived, eight months, closing on December 31, 1907. The quick closure suggests that the mining operations in the area either diminished rapidly or that the community did not sustain a large enough population to justify its continued operation. The legacy of ghost towns, like many mining towns of the era, once the mines were depleted or became unprofitable, the towns quickly dwindled, leaving behind the ghost towns. The brief operation of the fluorine post office indicates that fluorine was likely one such ephemeral mining town. The historical significance of the fluorine post office operation was brief. It is part of the larger narrative of Nevada's mining history, reflecting the boom and bust cycle typical of mining economies. The historical records and information about the Florine Post Office can be found in historical records and archives, including those maintained by the United States Postal Service and local historical societies. This post office is of interest to historians studying the mining history of Nevada and the development of postal services in remote areas. If you would like more specific details or records, you might consider reaching out to the Nye County Historical Society, the Nevada State Library and Archives, the United States Postal Service Archives, 
These institutions can provide more detailed records and possibly even original documents related to the Florine Post Office and the mining activities in Nye County during the early 20th century.